my dear friends myself dr rakesh kumar tripathi and in this video we are going to discuss how to express the square root of these numbers on real line on real line so to understand this first let's learn something general for example if i wish to express or root x root x root x on a real line i if i wish to express root x on a real line we will have to follow a specific specific procedure so what is that procedure let's draw a line segment of length x let's draw a line segment of length x extend this line by 1 cm this is what 1 cm okay and how much is this this is x so for drawing this root to 3.5 what we shall have to do draw a line segment of length 3.5 extend 1 cm more okay draw a perpendicular draw a perpendicular okay draw a perpendicular at this point let this point be o and this b a and this b b what is ao ao is ao is what ao is x okay and now take take midpoint of this ab what is midpoint of ab midpoint of ab will be somewhere here let this be midpoint and the midpoint let be this midpoint be c if this whole length is x plus 1 then this length will be x plus 1 by 2 x plus 1 by 2 okay draw a circle keeping c as center in your mind and ac as radius we shall find a circle like this okay what is this this may be like this okay so this is the circle where this line intersects this circle let this point be capital d okay what is cd you can see cd is radius this ca cb cd all are radii so therefore cd is radius and if cd is radius then what radius we have considered we have considered radius x plus 1 by 2 therefore this is x plus 1 by 2 okay nice and what is this co so to know about co co is what co is you can see co is this distance plus this distance or you can say that this distance minus this distance ao minus ac 
what is AO? AO, AO is X. AC, what is AC? X plus 1 by 2. So, 2X minus X, you take LCM, 2X minus plus minus and minus plus minus. X, 2X minus X is X minus 1 by 2. So, CO is X minus 1 by 2. CD is known to us, X plus 1 by 2. 2 this is CO but to know OD let's use Pythagoras theorem so in this right triangle in which right triangle in right triangle COD if I apply Pythagoras theorem CO square plus OD square is equal to CD square CO square x minus 1 by 2 square x plus 1 by 2 square is equal to cd square let's expand this x minus 1 square is x square plus 1 square co square plus OD square oh sorry CO square plus OD square is equal to CD square CD is X plus 1 by 2 whole square and this is X square plus 1 square minus 2X upon 2 square is 4 OD square is equal to X square plus 1 square plus 2X upon 4. OD square transferring all these values on right side except OD square. So it is X square plus 1 plus 2X upon 4 minus this x square plus 1 minus 2x upon 4 is equal to both are having same denominator therefore numerators can be added or subtracted directly x square plus 1 plus 2x minus x square minus 1 plus 2x x square x square cancelled 1 1 cancelled 2x plus 2x 4x 4x divided by 4 is what x what is this this is od square od square is equal to how much od square is equal to od square is equal to you can see od square is equal to x Therefore, OD is what? OD is root x. So, this distance is root x. So, now keep keeping this O as center in your mind. Draw a circle with this radius OD. OD. We will find a circle like this. There, where this point, this, where this point means where the intersecting point of circle and this line will be, let the point be P, this distance OP. Why? Because this is root x, so this will be root x. So this distance OP and point this P will be the location of this root x so what is op op is root x and if we wish to draw this root 3.5 root 3.5 let's apply the same procedure again 
what is that procedure let's understand how to express root 3.5 so it will be more clear to you how root 3.5 square root of 3.5 can be located on a real line to locate this root 3.5 draw a line first of length draw a line of length 3.5 okay and let this line segment be AO extend it one more centimeter so how much this would be this would be 4.5 4.5 take midpoint of this AB divide 4.5 by 2 so it would be 2.25 2.25 2.25 somewhere will be lying at this position let this be C distance between A and C is what 2.25 and same here 2.25 okay considering c as center ca as radius draw a circle draw a perpendicular at this point and to this line ab where this perpendicular intersects say this point is capital D and now keeping this as a center in your mind draw a circle with considering OD as radius this circle will be intersecting this extended line at this point let the point be P and the distance between O and P will be what? Distance between O and P will be root 3.5. This distance between O and P will be root 3.5. You can measure it yourself. And I request you to draw, means to locate all these points on real line yourself so keep practicing more and do learn more my good wishes with you all the best